Hello guys, welcome to the so today okay. <laughs> alright, alright, I overplayed it. Uh, I'm doing another thing. <laughs> thing. Um face cam again because it worked. Uh, uh here we go. Uh I'm gonna be quick about it. Thank you for calling technical support. My name is Daniel. How may I help you? Uh hi, I have something on my computer, it says uh, Microsoft System Security Alert. Oops, something went wrong with your Windows. It says the website you have recently visited may have downloaded the malware and virus on your Windows system. Mm -hmm. And, um... And sir, what you were doing when you got this message? Uh, I was watching YouTube and I, I, I don't know what happened. I might have clicked an ad by accident. Uh, it's Frederick. Alright, sir. And moreover, sir, is this the right number to reach you? If in case our call get disconnect, it's 610. Uh, that sounds right. I don't remember. Uh, yeah, that's correct. Sorry, I had to check it. It's okay. Alright, sir. So, first of what we need to do, we need to connect you with Microsoft Secure Server Connection. Then what I am going to do, I am going to run a quick scan on your computer system. It will let us know what's going wrong. That sounds to be good. Okay. Alright, sir. And moreover, sir, I would like to ask you, can you please let me know what is the make of your computer system? Um, it's a Lenovo, HP, Dell. It, it's an Acer computer. It's an Acer computer system. Alright, and moreover I would like to ask you which windows are you using? It's a Windows Vista 7, um, 8, 10. Windows 10. It's 10? Yeah. Alright sir, so what we are going to do, we are going to assist you some simple steps. You have to follow those steps so that we can connect you with our secure server connection, okay? Mm -hmm. So can you see at the left corner bottom of your keyboard, there is the control key. Can you see control key? Uh, yes. And can you please let me know which is the next key to control key? Uh, FN. Mm -hmm. And which is the next key to FN? Um, the, there's the Windows it's logo. It's a Windows key. Okay. It's a Windows key, am I right? Uh, yeah. It has the... Uh, logo of Windows. Now listen to me carefully. What you need to do, you need to press the Windows key down. While pressing it down, you need to press R. R as a Roger, okay? Okay. Yeah, it brought up a box that now says Run. Let me know run. what comes up. It says Run, and it has a space for me to type. Exactly. And can you please let me know if that <laughs> box is empty or it's filled? Uh, it's empty. It's empty. You need to type I as in Indiana. Okay. E as in Echo. L as in Lima. Okay. F as in Frank. A as an apple, S as a Sam, O M dot com. Okay, and now, now can you please repeat these words for me so that I can verify these words? Um, I explore space www dot fast support dot com. Exactly. Now click on OK and let me know what it says. Now it says establish support connection. Uh, it's still opening. Uh, it says set up Internet Explorer 11. And it says use recommended settings or don't use recommended settings. Can you say it says 
ask me later. Uh, yes. Click on ask me later, okay? Okay. <coughs> okay, it's... It says establish support connection. Do I type my name here and then... Exactly. Okay. You need to type your name and I am going to provide you the support key from my side, okay? <coughs> okay. Now what it says? Uh, installing go to assist customer. Daniel Smith. Now, Frederick, you need to click on yes. Alright, Frederick, now you are connected to my secure server connection. Now, can you see your cursor is moving? Uh, yeah, I see that. That's me, okay? Okay. So, just give me a moment, okay? Just give me a moment, alright? <laughs> Alright, so Frederick, I believe this is the message which you got on your computer system right now. Am I right? Yes. Alright. Alright, so Frederick, without wasting your time, what I am going to do, I am going to run a quick scan on your computer system. It will let us know what's going wrong, okay? Okay. I think it's less than a month old, maybe a couple weeks. That's why I was upset when I got the message. Oh my gosh, the CPU, I mean I don't really know what CPU is, but it says 99% and it's red. Give me a moment, sir. What I'm going to do, I'm going to assign the level 7 in technician. Okay, let me ask him, okay? One eternity later. Oh, I have an idea, actually. Mm -hmm. Just 
just give me a moment. Just give me a moment, sir. Please don't use your computer system, okay? Okay. Alright, so Frederick, what I am going to do, I am going to run a quick scan on your computer system. It will let us know what's going wrong, okay? Mm -hmm. <coughs> Sir, how was your day being so far? Oh, oh, how I'm sorry. Day? Um, yeah, it, I mean, it's, eh, not too great. I have a headache, so it's not... Yeah. In which state do you live in? Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Okay, so how is the weather over there? Uh last weekend it was it was pretty hot for February at least. Mm -hmm. It was like seventy degrees. Oh, okay. It's global warming. Sorry, I didn't get you what you said. It, it's it's because of global warming. Oh, okay. So what do you do for your living? Um, <clears throat> I don't really have a like a a main job yet, but uh, right now I'm just I work at like McDonald's. Oh, okay. I'm still. Uh, working for a degree. Mm -hmm. Spyware detected. All right, sir. So the scan has been detected. <coughs> it says spyware detected. Warning. Yeah. Do you know what is spyware? Um, is it like? Is it like a virus that shows people my information? Exactly. You know, spyware is a technique which is used by the hackers to spy on your computer system. They can steal your identity, they can steal your credit card information, they can steal any kind of information, alright, for their legal and illegal purposes. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <coughs> Let me check one more thing, okay? <coughs> Alright, sir. And can you see it says foreign address? Mm -hmm. And can you see there are lots of foreign address who are already established with your computer system? Can you see established, established, established? Yeah. What does time wait mean? There are lots of people. Mm -hmm. What does time wait mean? The next one. Sorry, I didn't get to what you said. This this one says time wait. What does that mean? So time wait means there are lots of people, you know, who are still waiting to get connected with your computer system. There are lots of them who are still waiting to get connected with your computer system. Okay. Mm -hmm. oh. So mm -hmm. let me check one more thing. Just give me a moment, okay? Mm -hmm. And have you shared your Wi Fi password with anyone else? Um, I think. Yeah, I have, with a couple friends. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Alright, so it says firewall disabled. Can you see that? Yeah. Do you know what is firewall? Um, the, the, I think it like blocks, um, it blocks bad connections from getting to your Wi-Fi. 
So without wasting your sir, uh, without wasting your time, what I am going to do, I am going to assist you how to fix this problem, okay? What we need to do, we need to remove spywares, okay? Malwares and virus, okay? <laughs> and then what we need to do, we need to get some securities which can take care of your computer system. What we need to do, we need to enable the firewall, okay? We need to install anti-hacking tool, okay? Mm -hmm. <coughs> Once we're done with this, you will not face any kind of problem, okay? Okay. That sounds good. So there would be a technic. Mm -hmm. So there would be a negligible technician fees, okay? Okay. In order to fix, uh, in order to fix your computer system, there is a one-time fix. All right. Mm-hmm. Which would be one zero nine dot nine nine dollars, okay? Okay. So if you want I can assign the technician who would be going to work on your computer system, okay? Okay. Alright, sir. Just give me a moment, let me register you, okay? Mm -hmm. So the mode of payment would be through debit card, okay? Okay. Alright, so just give me a moment. And moreover, sir, I would like to suggest you one more thing. Just give me a moment, okay? Mm -hmm. In 109.99, it would be one time fix, okay? Okay. If you would be going to add Fifty dollars, you would be getting one year of technical support as well. It's totally up to you. Mm -hmm. One year of technical support means if you face any kind of problem with your computer system, you don't need to spend a single penny for complete one year. Adding like adding like fifty dollars, you can get protected for complete one year. Mm -hmm. I think. So I you just... want to get one time fix, or you want? Mm -hmm. I think for now I'll just get the one time fix. <coughs> That's okay. That's okay. Is is there? Oh, okay. Never mind. All right. So, if you have any kind of doubts, you can ask me. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, sir. So without wasting your time, let me uh, get your notepad for you. <laughs> All right, sir. Just give me a moment, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, sir. So let me guide you. The Microsoft technical team. You know there are lots of Microsoft technical team which are, you know, working on the technical support department. Mm -hmm. So what I have done, I have assigned this case to one of the most, you know, best technician team who will be going to work on your computer system, okay? Mm -hmm. I sub solutions in corporate, okay? Mm -hmm. And the corporate address of this technical team is in 31 Kidbrook Road, Brampton, Ontario, Canada. All right. Mm -hmm. And moreover, so if in case in future you face any kind of problem, these are our to uh, toll free numbers. All right. Mm -hmm. You can call us on this number at any point of time, all right? Mm -hmm. And moreover, the plan which you are going for, it's 109.99, am I right? Uh, yes, yes. <coughs> and the 10 year would be one time fix. Mm -hmm. Okay? Yeah. 
So what you need to do, and moreover, let me guide you my information as well. My name is Daniel Smith. If in case in future you face any kind of problem, you can call us at any point of time. Um, and you are you still there? Oh uh, yeah, I'm back. Okay, so, um, should I, oh. Just give me a moment. Okay. So what you need to do, you need to type your name, address, phone number, and email, okay? Mm -hmm. okay? In order to register you, if there would be any initial or middle name, you need to type the initial and middle name as well, okay? Okay, one second. Okay, um... Mm -hmm. It's not debit. Is that okay? It's, it's a credit card. It's a credit card. And may I know mm -hmm. which credit card you would be going to use? It's a Master or it's a Visa? The Discover. Yes. Just turn on the line, sir. Just give me a moment. Let me ask my billing management. Just turn on the line, okay? All right. Mhm. Mm Actually, sir, I had the words with my billing management. You know, there is some kind of server problem, so that's why we are not dealing in the discovered card right now at this point of time. So, mm -hmm. if it is possible for you, can you use your Visa or Mastercard? Uh, the only card I have is Discover. It's Discover. Yeah, that's a problem. I know you have to use either Visa or it's a MasterCard, you know. Right now, we are not dealing in the Discover card. There is some kind of, you know, server issues. So if it is possible for you. Um, yeah, I, I, don't, I don't have a way to use anything else. Or what we can do, we can do the payment through the check. If it is possible for you, can you please mail us the check? Uh, yeah, I can do that. Okay. Alright, just give me a moment. If it is possible for you, can you please grab your checkbook along with you so that I can help you to fill the check? Uh, yeah. Okay, I got it. Have you got your checkbook? Yes, I got it. All right, just give me a moment. How long have you worked there? You sound like you know so what it you're would doing. Take us like thirty-five to. Mm -hmm. How long have you worked there? So we work for twenty-four by seven. No, how long? If just I meant. Number, we I meant you personally, like how long have you, uh, been working there? You sound like you know what you're doing. Sir, so it would take us like 35 to 45 minutes no, in order to fix No, I'm, I'm saying like, how... There are lots of, you know, suspicious activities in order to remove all those suspicious activities. It would take us like 45 minutes. I'm, I'm saying like how, how, you personally, like how, when did you start working there? at that for that company sorry sir i am not getting you how, how long have you um had that job when sir, did you get it solutions it's a technical team which is pinpoint partners of microsoft you know microsoft it's a global brand yeah so there are lots of companies you know there are lots of you know organizations which are working under the microsoft so iso solutions it has been in the business from last eight years 80 from years last eight years it is the pinpoint partners of Microsoft. For 80 years? 8 years. Oh, 8. I thought you said 80. I was going to say that's that doesn't sound right. That's okay. <laughs> so, have you grabbed your checkbook? Oh, uh, yes. Yeah. Alright, sir. So, the name which would be appear on your checkbook 
it would be ISAP Solutions Incorporated. Mm -hmm. Make sure the name which you would be going to write on the checkbook, it's ISAP, it's a single word, okay? It's mm -hmm. ISAP Solutions okay. Incorporated. Tap it on your checkbook. Yeah. Have you done with this? Mm -hmm. And moreover, the corporate address on which you are going to mail us this check, you need to type this address <laughs> at the back side of your check. Flip your check and you have to write this address at the back side of your checkbook, okay? Mm -hmm. It's 31 Kidbrook Road, Brampton, Ontario. That's the postal code L6P286, Canada. All right. Mm -hmm. Do you have a degree? Please write down this corporate address. Mm -hmm. What what what's your um your degree, like your certification? I I wrote that down. Sorry, sir. I... Mm -hmm. What what's your degree like? How how far did you go in college? So I have done the BTEC in computer science. I'm a BTEC student. Pass out last year. Hmm. So in computer science. I have done software engineering. Okay. Hmm. Why didn't you get a real job then? Sorry, sir. I didn't get you what you are trying to why, say. Why? Why didn't you get a like a regular job where you were actually doing something for your money that was worth your time? It's wasting my time, you know. It's my duty to take care of all the computer system. Uh, if anyone of our clients, but you're not taking care of, of computers. Their, their computer system, we just fix them. That uh, you're not fi you're not helping people with their computers. You're pretending to. <laughs> By the way, this is not. One minute. So it's totally up to you. If you're okay. not feeling comfortable, I'm not forcing you to get the services, okay? Okay. But what about people who do take it? What do you do with their information, their credit cards? What do you do with that information? So do you, do you use their... We never disclose any kind of information. I know you, I know you won't, dis I know you won't disclose it. Else, you'll okay? use it, though. You'll, you'll steal money from their credit cards. And they won't find out until it's too late. So it's totally up to you. If you don't want to proceed, it's totally up to you. I'm not forcing you to get the services, okay? Mm hmm Okay. That's it's totally up to you. Do you Alright, so Fred, do you, anything else with whom I can assist you? Uh, do you know what a virtual machine is? It's totally up to you. It's, uh, you know, I'm not recommending do, you to get the do services you, do from you, our company. You can either take the computer system do you know to your local store. Okay. Do you know what a virtual machine is? Mm -hmm. I'm using a virtual machine. So are you going to do anything to me? Alright, so Frederick, uh, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to disconnecting you from... No, 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 wait, wait, no, you, did, you didn't answer my question. You did not answer my question. <laughs> yes, you did. You just didn't want to answer it. Mm -hmm. Yes, you can ask any kind of question. If you have any kind of doubt, you can ask it. Uh, one second. What do you want to do now? What are you going to do now? From here. I'm giving you... I'm, I'm giving you steps. What what are you gonna do next? We are not going to do anything, sir. I'm just going to be out of your computer. Hit session. enter. Hit enter. Mm -hmm. Hit enter. Why I should click enter? Do you, do you know what it's gonna do? Yeah, I can totally understand what it's do. Okay. Okay. Then tell me what it does. Because it's not what you mm -hmm. think. Yeah, sure, sir. It's totally up to you. You know, I totally do understand what you're doing. This is Siski. Okay? This is Siski. It's just the same. 
as CMD. Except not really, because CMD is Task Manager. And if you type Task Manager, that opens Command Prompt. It's all a mess. So, so do you do you have anything you'd like? Have you given the access of your computer system to any other else? You know, like any other technician. Do you have anything you'd like to say to YouTube? Do you have anything to say to YouTube? I totally do understand, sir. Are you? Do you want to say anything? Do you want to say anything to YouTube? You're on. You're going to be on YouTube tomorrow, or pretty soon at least. Do you have anything to say? <laughs> it's totally up to you. What do you okay. mean it's totally up to me? What's totally up to me? You're putting you on YouTube? Yeah, you can upload. You can upload my uh, video. On no, YouTube. I'm. I'm it's saying, okay. do you have anything to say on YouTube? Mhm. Mm yeah, sure. All right. Okay. Well, I hope I hope you get. You can a, upload me. I hope you get a real job. All right. They ended.